everyone, it's Scott Funning in here. How you doing, everybody? Oh, this basically this video is about a lot of people. Are, I've seen some nasty comments been quoted on me by Andre, or however how you pronounce his name, or her or she, not her name. It's a he or she. Well, first off, I'm not no snitch. Okay. Uh, if anyone probably read the comment, I reported it as uh, cyberbullying and harassment. There's quite a few comments she's put up already on my on my YouTube, <clears throat> or anyone. First off, if you didn't want me to be posting videos of you guys coming through the hallways, stuff like that, should have considered this. To whoever, maybe not you, done it, but the thing is, if you left me alone, completely left me alone. I mean, whoever did it. Came up in my apartment, stole my laptop. I was out in front porch and this happened. Um, shouldn't uh, after that you should have known I would not drop anything after that because it's a bunch of crap. Okay, you shouldn't have stole my laptop. Next thing, you shouldn't have stole my cameras. If you left me alone. Only done nothing. It was just simple as that. Nope, you want to keep on doing what you want to do. Be a dumbass people that just comes over here and uses uh, whoever in the apartments here to so you don't yeah so you can do your drugs, your prostitution, all that stuff here, which is not acceptable. So. You know, that's not how is how people don't down any neighbor or anybody around you is not gonna don't not gonna accept that. To let you know, you don't care who the people you screw over. For one, or you don't you don't give a damn about who like Dwayne. He didn't give a shit. And even don't he don't give a shit. What's going on? It's like uh, this morning. Um, he denies it, but somebody downstairs in the apartment three was running a kerosene heater to keep warm the place. I had to call the fire department on that because the fumes were so bad up here because of it. So, well, at least the situation was solved. The, the furnace was turned on finally. The landlord told us to turn the furnace on so it better keep warm. So I was fine because the heat rises up here anyways. So. Besides, I, I had to stay outside to the fumes cleared out of the apartment before I even came back up here. I had sat there for at least two to three hours because somebody decided to pull, uh, burn a kerosene heater downstairs and could cause the maybe a chance our bug might burn down the place. If you consider that, no, you don't give a damn. It's like with the bed bugs, you don't give a damn. You know. Don't care about what's around you, what's going on, your neighbors. You know, what you do in this apartment building affects us too. So, you just don't give a shit. So, if you gave a damn and take responsibility, there won't be no problems. So, you're going to learn it the hard way. So, yeah. So you, you can call me a snitch, and I'm, I'm not no snitch, for one. So you're mad because I got your video on, your your face on YouTube. What you got to hide, then? You are making a big deal out of it. So all you do is going to cause more problems and more, and besides, really, no, I've been told, <laughs> I've been told the police station is watching my YouTube channel. So you're... You're screwing yourselves in the process by drawing attention by complaining about them. That means you have something to hide. So, um, if you wanted to, well, probably not gonna bring the cameras back, but so if you want uh, deposits from my pod, donate some money to my GoFundMe page, like sixty dollars, and I'll take those videos down. And I still post them up over and over again until you do that. 
And then it's like, you know, you know, you're screwing yourself in the process. So I try to tuck my camera. She's trying to install my laptop. And she hadn't been in my life. So that's why I don't invite those kind of people in my place. I don't have that kind of people. So. Uh, and the, but the good note is, I might have a place lined up for me to move to. But I still got to come up with the money to take care of the deposit and moving expenses and everything else. So, yeah. And that's still an issue right now. So. Alright, that's pretty much all I got to say at this point. If you got a problem me asking for help on YouTube, you know how simple it is to you don't like it don't watch my YouTube videos don't subscribe to me don't get on my Facebook simple as that if you have a problem with it just don't bother you on my fucking on my YouTube or my Facebook if you have a problem with it that's as simple I don't know why you want to keep on just come back and make some comments you're the ones watching it, not me. I'm not forcing you to do anything. Not like I'm not forcing anybody to give me money. I'm just giving people a choice if they want to help or not. There's people that do want to help. And there are people helping me and they care at least. Not by pay, not donating money, but watching my videos. And sharing all my videos. Sharing the videos and stuff like that. That's being supportive. I'm not asking for much for a lot of people. I mean, I wish it'd be, help, it'd be helpful, but, again, so, I have to go through this situation with the landlord now, about the whole, what's going on downstairs and the bed bug situation, now I'm, I'm going to have to get rid of the bed bugs, so, again, but like I said, nobody care, so, alright, but that's all I got to say right now, so, that's what's going on. Uh, I appreciate what you guys want anybody watching this video and y'all have a good night um, or day wherever you watch this. So alright, have a good one.